two best teams defensively in the Big Ten Conference Tangle. Who's going to make shots? Who's going who's gonna to be the winner? And tonight it ends up being Purdue. Vera and Dan back with you. And it was a, a dogfight throughout. Purdue just kind of seemed to turn things on and make those final few shots while Michigan went cold. I think they did the best job of attacking the paint, getting some penetration looks. There was some baseline penetration and baseline penetration and pitch. And so they did a really good job of knowing that this is where we're going to score the baskets. And then later on, they were able to open up the perimeter. Brittany Rayburn getting some threes. Yeah, speaking of the native of Attica, Indiana, Brittany Rayburn took a while for her to get going, but when she was on, she just kept it churning. Well, again, there's that baseline attack, the dribble pull up. That's really her game. She's a good spot up shooter, but she wants that one or two dribble pull up. That's how she gets her rhythm. Here she just spots up with range for the three, and they did a good job of recognizing, hey, Brittany is hot, give her the basketball. It just doesn't get any simpler than that offensively. She was hot, 15 points on the night for Brittany, looking at the numbers through 40 minutes, and on the boards, Michigan Michigan wins the battle, but they suffer the loss. Well, I think the biggest thing to notice is that Purdue has struggled with turnovers from time to time. They had only 11. That is very, very low for any team. And when you're protect, protecting every possession and get protecting every possession and getting those types of uh, low turnover games, you're you're going to increase your opportunity to win those tough ones. And it was a tough one, but it's got to feel real good for Jaron Versip and the Purdue Boilermakers. They had dropped four of their last five conference games, including three straight. But tonight they play the spoiling role, rooting Michigan's senior night with the 11-point victory over the Wolverines.